Mrs. Kindly lived her house in very long time. And she also had a good friend like Thomas the Tank Engine, Toby, and Percy. But however, anything is going to change. After Christmas Day, it was a few days on January. Thomas the Tank Engine was puffing along with his branch line pulling a Clarabelle. As he passed Mrs. Kindly's house, he discovered that Mrs. Kindly was nowhere to be seen. Tom was looking puzzled. Later at Farquhar, Thomas stopped at the station. He see Mrs. Kindly's husband was at the platform. Tom was looking concerned. That night at the sheds, Thomas told Percy and Toby all about that. Mrs. Kindly has her family, Thomas, said Toby. She is a nice woman, said Percy. We all remember that Mrs. Kindly will take on Christmas party, said Toby. Thomas could understood, but however, sadly, at times change into sad. The next morning, when Thomas stopped at Mrs. Kindly's house, he saw Mrs. Kindly's husband. He looking upset. Thomas's driver climbed down and went to the cottage. What's the matter? asked Thomas's driver. Mrs. Kindly husband look at Thomas' driver. <sighs> I'm really sorry, he said. Mrs. Kindly got very, very ill, and she got passed away. Thomas was speechless in shock, and he was upset too. His tears came around his eyes hopefully his memories it wasn't lucky she doesn't have a deep scar said thomas's driver no she didn't said mrs kindly husband she was at the bed all the time thomas felt depressed Mrs. Kindly's family went to the funeral. Thomas could say goodbye to Mrs. Kindly. I miss you, Mrs. Kindly. The memories for Christmas. And Thomas left. With his memories of Mrs. Kindly's and his branch line.